guys, it's me, Wicked Fantasy. So, you guys, I know my posting, uh, posting schedule has been off this week. You know, I told you I was going to post on um, Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays. But I got thrown off this week, and I didn't want to not post. So, I just um, went ahead and posted on Tuesday and, you know, not Thursday. So today I was doing something a little bit different since I'm trying to be like in the holiday spirit. Now I know a lot of people don't drink this because it is definitely an acquired taste. It's a little thick and a little strong so it's kind of like you know. But I got some eggnog you guys. Let me see if you can see. And I added a little uh, whipped cream and I added a little cinnamon on top. I also added a little milk you guys to cut it a little bit because it is kind of strong a little bit. Then I got these little cookies. I don't know if you guys know um, the little Milano cookies, you know. They're like the little buttery cookie on the outside and then it's like the chocolate on the inside. So I got some of those, you guys. So Basically, that's what I got today. So it's a little holiday treat. And um, they're pretty inexpensive. You could get both of these for under $10. So um, if you're looking for something like that you want to give to someone, you could do, I know it's a little corny, don't come for me in the comments, okay? You could do like a little basket where you do the little cookies. Obviously, you would leave them in the, you know, the thing it comes in or whatever. Or you could put them in something else. But, you know, you have the little cookies, have the little eggnog, you know, and maybe have like, um... What else could you put in there? Like, you know, the little holiday popcorn. I don't know if you guys are a fan of that, but you know the one that got like the butter and then they got the cheese and the caramel. I love that one. So maybe even you could throw some of that in there or chocolates. Chocolates is like a thing too. So that's a nice little gift idea because I know I was supposed to tell you guys about the gift under $20. So now you guys, you don't have to put the Cool Whip on top. I'm just being extra because I love Cool Whip. And also, you guys, because I don't know if you've had nutmeg before, um, it's a pretty strong spice. So, um, I just feel like the Cool Whip and the cinnamon kind of cut it down a little bit. So it was not so bad. But I'm not sitting here saying like I'd be sitting up guzzle in it, but around the holidays, every now and then I do get it. And I get these little cookies all year because I just love them. But, what are you guys doing for Christmas? Are you guys cooking or, you know, I cooked for Thanksgiving. And honestly, I love to cook, so. I, I was looking at that thing. I know y'all like, what the hell is that? Listen, don't don't come for my clothes, y'all. Okay, don't worry about what I got on. Don't worry about what I got on. Anyway, listen. I'm here for the video. So, I don't know. I want to cook for Christmas, but I be feeling like I be overdoing it because there be so much food left. So, I'm like, you know what? I'm debating do I want to do like a big Christmas dinner this year. So I thought about doing pasta. And you guys. I actually think that's what I'm going to do. I was on TikTok. <laughs> I was on TikTok again. And, um, they got this, like, um, who's it called? Like this, it's like a TikTok spaghetti. But it's kind of like a little casserole. Because it has Alfredo in it, too. It's like a little cheesy bake thing. So I've been seeing it. And I finally saw the ingredients, like, of somebody making it, like, step by step. Actually, it was lovely Mimi. I was watching her channel. And she was making it. Um, it looked really good. So, because I was thinking about maybe doing something different for um Christmas. You guys, I think I'm gonna make that. I think I'm gonna make that, and I'm gonna do like some little garlic knots. And um, you guys know I love corn on the cob, so. 
I think I'm going to do like the corn. Like, I don't know if you remember my last Alati's video. I learned how to make that. And I made it in the cup. But I was telling you guys, you could eat it on the cob too. So I think I would make it that way this time. So I think that it be something different, you know. And I love banana pudding. I haven't had it in a while. So I think I might make that too. So it's just a thought. And then you guys, <clears throat> people do not be into eggnog like that. You should see how they was licking me when I was buying it. <laughs> like you drink that shit. <laughs> um, it, it I, I know how it's kind of like off putting them. I bet you guys, I don't know. I like it. But anyway, I'm not gonna drag this out forever. I don't have a whole lot to talk about, but you guys. When I do the, the TikTok spaghetti, I'm going to definitely vlog it so you guys can see when I make it. When I was done doing mukbang, so we're going to see how it turns out. And also, but it was another one, like a Rasta pasta. Now, I've bought the Alfredo sauce. Now, I'm not going to lie, I've always wanted to make the sauce from scratch. I know you can just use like the heavy whipping cream, but I don't know. I didn't really know how to use it like that, so I was nervous about doing it. But I watched another video where somebody made it, and it looked really good. So I think I want to try that, too. I might do that for New Year's, you guys. Maybe do that, like, in garlic bread and salad or something. I know you're like, you already thinking about... <sighs> Greedy. Yes, I'm already thinking about it. So. I did not need to eat that much at that one time. Okay, so... I'm going to try that. Um, you guys. Next week. I'll be back on my um, regular schedule. It was just this week that been a little crazy. But. I've been watching this show on Netflix. Called Sweet Home. It's like a Japanese flick. But. Um, it's like with these monsters, kind of like the end of the world or something like that, but I'm going to tell it all. But you guys, I, it has been cracking me up. I have been watching it. I like it though. And then I heard, um, on Facebook, it's a series called Prisoners. It's supposed to be really good. I haven't watched it yet. I'm, I'm going to watch it and then I'm going to let you guys know if it was good, but they said it was really good, so. Which I saw it when I was scrolling. I almost watched it. But I ended up watching this. And then I started getting into this. So, But you guys. Like I said. I didn't have a whole lot to say today. I just wanted to come on here. Because I know I haven't been on here like that. Um, just kind of say what's up. If you're a new, uh, a new subscriber. Or hopefully new subscriber, but new watcher. Welcome to the channel. And if you're a returning subscriber, you already know, baby. Welcome back. So, like I said before in my last video, don't forget to follow me on my other platforms. You can follow me on TikTok or Instagram. It's the same handle, which is a wicked six 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 fantasy. So, um, and then like I told you guys, I, I've been staying on it. I'm going to start posting to my shorts every day because I, I really felt bad when I was going so hard with the other platforms. I just felt like I could have gave it more energy here. So, you know, I would like to get to a point where I was posting like three shorts a day, but you guys, it's kind of a lot, so I don't know. But definitely, I'm going to post once a day. And usually I do it real early in the morning because I'll be up by 6.30 in the morning. Um... That's when I be doing it. But I do most of my filming. I'm like, you like, what? Greedy. And that's when I do most of my filming. Early in the morning, so. Anyway, I'm getting back on schedule. I'm getting back on schedule. But, I'm not going to bore you guys too long. 
And that's another thing, you guys. I gotta go to the nail shop. My nails is trash. So, I might also vlog that too. I don't know if you guys are into that. I think I did it before. I don't remember how that went, but if you like the video, don't forget to like. If there's anything you guys want to say, no. Um, if you want to know where I got any of this stuff from, or like I said before, any suggestions for upcoming videos, don't forget to comment. And my personal favorite, don't forget to subscribe. Bye.